Hello, good evening and welcome back to the Houseborns World YouTube channel. If you're a new visitor with this video, I'd really appreciate you going and have a look around some of the other videos I've done. Maybe give me a subscribe and definitely a like for this video. So if you are one of my existing subscribers, you would know that I am starting a little mini Lego Speed Champions collection. And in some previous videos, I've tied this in with racing the Lego Speed Champions car around different tracks in a VR PC simulator. Now, some time ago on Twitter, if I can dig out the tweet, we're going maybe a couple of years ago, I can't distinctly remember, there was a guy that had built a prototype Nissan GTR and he posted it to Lego and posted it to Nissan and I remember tweeting at the time you've really got to make this happen and obviously it's not just only me who wanted this to happen there are many people in the world and I must admit I knew some new Lego Speed Champion models were out but to my surprise the other day, when I was in the shops, it is here, it has arrived, the Lego have partnered up with Nissan. Now this is the Nissan GTR Nismo model, not sure if it's meant to be based on the GT3 or the base model, uh, doesn't actually confirm that. But obviously the GTR is a 3.2 litre V6 twin turbo. Standard car these days pushing out 575 horsepower. In the Nismo model, that's ramped up to 600 brake horsepower, but has got slightly subtle uh, dimensional changes on the width of the suspension. The actual suspension itself uh, uses different struts and is a lot more rigid body than the standard GTR. So what I'm going to do guys and girls, I'm just going to take you round the box and have a look round it. We'll get the box open and then I'm going to do a time lapse of the build. And in an upcoming video series that I've just started, uh, I'm seeing how fast I can get cars around the uh, Secuba circuit. We will be getting the Nismo GTR around that in a coming up video. But just to quickly have a look around the box. I like how on the front they've got the GTR drifting around a corner. When we step to the side, can't actually see, you've just got the side model, the Lego Speed Champions. On the back you've got a very nice rear shot of the rear end of the GTR. I think that makes this look very distinctive in the Lego model. We've also got a picture of what looks like a GT3 car there and we've got a shot of the guy inside. Uh, coming around to this side, we've just got the Lego logos, and then there we've got the Nissan stamp of authority, and we've got barcode there. So, let's just get this open. This is probably the worst part, because it's never going to be the same once you've opened the box. But we've got to pop that up to... Uh, to do this without ripping the box. There we go. Didn't really want to uh, damage it as such. So I've just opened the box up from the rear. I've made a bit of a hash of that. I wanted to do a neater job. I've slightly ripped the back. I'm annoyed about that. Um, to be honest, why have you made it so it opens up that way? That's highly disappointing, to be honest. I'd just rather a box where you can undo the end and not ruin it, because that's just not a rigid box anymore. But anyway, enough about boxes. So inside we've got bag number one. With some bits and pieces. I love the guy's little Nissan suit. 
we've got the very base of the car we've got bag number two Can you get these out we have the stickers which I believe I saw this on Twitter there is a mistake in the instructions We've got to make sure we get the stickers the right way and of course we have the product manual manual guide install build guide that we'll be going through anyway we're going to jump into the time lapse I've got to say Lego that's just ruined the box that's miffed me that has I like I wanted to keep this pristine I'm gonna have to do a bit of a sellotape job and I've ripped it open but anyway let's go on with the time lapse And after that very quick time lapse, here we have the final product. So this is the Nissan driver in his racing overalls. And here we have the Nissan Nismo GTR. I really am surprised how well they've captured the shape of the car because it really is distinctly a Nissan GTR. Some of the Lego Speed Champions cars look very, very similar, even though you can always work out what they are, but this is just uniquely a Nissan GTR shape. I really do like this. Really, I'm proud of this one. So, as with all my other models, I've just got to get the driver into the car. There we go. Driver in pride of place. The Nissan GTR Nismo Lego Speed Champions build, time lapse build. Alright guys and girls, it is very late, it's nearly midnight, everybody else has gone to bed so I'm just going to have to keep this one on a quieter note. 
Thank you very much for watching my LEGO Speed Champions and Nissan Nismo GTR build. Please do watch out for the next video. We're going to get this round to Cuba and see what it comes on our time trial series that we're running. I'm going to be doing some more flight simulator stuff. We've got Boneworks and Black Mesa to finish before the release of Half-Life Alex. Will I get a Valve Index before that? It's looking mightily sketchy. I've also got all the other content on the channel that I've brought to you before. I set a course of Competitia Zone. I need to get back onto that. Really wanted the Valve Index to be doing that, but anyway. Stay tuned for more videos to come. If you've enjoyed this, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like, give me a thumbs up, and I will see you very soon in more videos to come. Peace out.